Hello, welcome to bcping.com. This is Arun Nair. In this video, I'm going to show you how to access the files on your PC from an Android device wirelessly. Sounds cool? All right, let's get started. Step one, install the free app called ES File Explorer on your Android device. It is available from the Play Store. As I said, it's free of cost. Step two, enable sharing for those folders on your PC that you want to access from your Android device. In order to do this, log into your computer with a local administrator account. Then right click on the folder that you want to share. Click properties. You will see a sharing tab. Click share and enter the list of users whom you want to add. So for example, you know, I, I want to add Arun, but it is easier if you just go ahead and add everyone. All right, because it's just your home network and there is re really nothing to worry. Now you can define the permission level. So for example, if you give read, then all users will be able to only read the files. They cannot modify or save new files to this folder. However, if you give read or write, then users will be able to edit and modify the files and they can also save new files to this location. So for now, I'm just going to leave it to read, then click share. Click done, close, and you're done. Now to access these files, just go to your Android device, click ES File Explorer, and you will see this icon on the top left corner. Click that, and you will see an option called Network. If you expand that, you will see an option called LAN. Click that, and you, you need to click on this button called New and you will have to enter all this information. Now, the first field, the domain, it is optional. You don't have to enter that because you're in a home network. Now, the second field, server, you need to enter the IP address of the server. Now, the server is nothing but your PC here, okay? So, I, I will go ahead and enter the IP address of my PC. Now, if you're not sure how to find the IP address of your PC, uh, I, I can just uh, show it to you. Just click Start, type CMD, and hit enter you will get this command prompt which is a black screen type IP config just one word and hit enter and you will see this IPv4 IP address that's your IP address alright so my IP address is 10.0.0.254 yours might be like 192.168.1.1 or 2.1 it could be anything you just go to that command prompt and type IP config and see that Right, so I'm entering my IP address. I'm entering my username here, Arun, and I'm entering my password. And optionally, I can I can set a display name here. For example, if you have multiple computers at your home, uh, probably you might have a laptop or you may have a desktop in your bedroom. So you know, if you want an identification, I can I can just enter a display name here. So I'm going to enter the display name as desktop and I click OK so I get here you see this now I click on desktop I can see a lot of things here don't, don't freak out you know this C dollar E dollar IPC dollar admin dollar whatever you see as dollar they are called admin shares and regular users will not be able to access them anyway so you don't have to worry about them so you see your shared content here so I click that and I can see a text file which I created there so I click that and I can read it now I can go to the pictures folder and I can open the picture see it, it's just loading so fast because you're on the local area network you can even you can even watch movie if you have a movie file there you can just click that and you can watch a movie all right so i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you